Hey everybody, this is Don over at Johnny's Used Cars. Voted the best place to buy a car in Okinawa by the military community of Okinawa. Uh, today I'm gonna show this 2005 Toyota Alphard that just came in. It's got 81,000 kilometers on it, which is about 50,000 miles. Uh, before we get started, I'd like to let you know that we do have on a lot discounts. So the price you're seeing on the website right now will not be the final price when you come on a lot. Also, if you're arriving to Okinawa soon or you just arrived, please make sure you stop by Johnny's Used Cars as soon as you can and have a look around. Even before you get yourself a driver's license, there are benefits in uh, doing it that way. So with that, let's gonna have a look around. I'll show you the features inside. But first, I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos. gonna answer a lot of your questions. Things like the JCI, the warranty, the uh, road tax. I cover all that and more. So please bear with me till the end. You have all the answers. If not, please contact me or stop on by. The Soda Alphard is an eight passenger vehicle in the 300 series category, so the larger category. Road tax per year is going to be 19,000 yen, which is about $160 right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April, May time frame. So we're going to take care of it for you this year. You won't have to worry about it until next. Now you do have uh, two options to pay for it. First one being US dollars cash outright, which could get you a larger discount. Or you can take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Yes, we don't have a down payment requirement, but if you want some down, reduce your overall monthly payments, you can. A lot of our customers do like 500 to 1,000. Some do half, some do more. Up to you. Before you go inside, I was like showing the rain guards. Rain guards will allow you to roll your windows down a little bit this way. If it rains, it's not going to get wet inside. More important feature benefit is you give you a cross ventilation, get that extremely hot air out. And always get yourself a good windshield visor. All right. So like I said, I think I said it, this one just came in, so it's going to be a little dirty, but this is actually really clean just for a couple spots. So let's get this baby started. All right. Sneak this in. Hey, this has 85,000. Hold on a second. Turn that radio off, sorry. Sorry, this has 85,000. Uh, 360 on the odometer. That's about uh, 54,000 miles, I guess. Okay, let's show you a couple other warning lights. Uh, that one right there, the blinking one, obviously your seatbelt one, make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. And then that circular one is your uh, emergency brake. This one's a kick type, so when you kick it, disengage, it goes away, kick it again, comes right back on. Other than that, it's a very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. I think pops up on a dash while you're driving. Please pull over, find out what it is, take the necessary action. Off the left here, you have your radio. This one does have a rear camera. Uh, your air conditioning controls, your shifter, ashtray lighter, or a power outlet, and a little other compartment for some storage. Uh, that I think is for like a subwoofer, maybe? I don't know. And then just a little more storage. They got the buttons here. A little more storage, okay, it's pretty cool. And then more storage, you guessed it. What is this thing? Just pads. All right. And then uh, continuing off to the left, above the glove box, you have this little area for storage and then the glove box itself. And a little bit of storage and cup holder on each door panel. Okay, hopefully you saw that other one. That is your passenger space over there. You get your red roof flare hanging out. Then this is the space I have on my side. The seat is now all the way back and all the way down i am 511 as everybody loves knowing uh i can drive as is or slide this up maybe a, another inch or two this one does have um uh a compartment for sunglasses as well let's go eye level that's my eye level right there really can't see anything past the windshield wipers like on most vehicles go all the way back and normally is the time i showed an auction sheet showing you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland japan please keep that in mind non-accident vehicle from mainland all these other dealers out here can't tell you that. We can on all our cars. But because it just came in, I keep those inside the office till a bit detailed. Once detailed, I'm gonna put it up here on the sun visor on the driver's side. What do we got here? Uh, got a couple cards here. Eh, probably not money, but all right. That's where that's gonna go, okay? Um, what other thing? Let's uh, open the door. Let's show you a couple other items before we go to the back seat. AC's working very, very nicely. So let's just start down here. That's your ETC reader, electronic toll collector. This works like easy pass in the states if you're able to get the card for it for the expressway. This does have dual power sliding doors, okay? And then these are your uh, uh, controls for uh, the mirror, excuse me. And then you do have an option of turning the power doors off over here. And then on the right side of the dash, or right side of the, or on the door panel, sorry, door lock and window controls right here. And then over on the, underneath on the right side of the dash, you have your uh, coin coin box. And then down here, please don't forget two levers. One on the right is your gas cover release. One on the left is your hood release. Please don't forget that's there, okay? So let's uh, turn this baby off. Let's go to the back seat. It's got a weird looking uh, rear view mirror. All right, let's 
go over here. Now you just pull this one time and it's not going. So it's beeping, so I'm gonna guess that the wire's broken, so we're gonna uh, get that fixed, okay? But, oh, and as you can see, it's on a rail system, so you can slide these forward if you want, and these will also swivel around. So if you wanna face the back, then you can do that. Yep, you can do that. I'm gonna show you that hopefully here in a second. So I believe this seat is all the way back. Where is it? So this is with the seat all the way back, okay? I'm over a foot and a half away from the back of the seat to my knees. Uh, each seat back does have pocket storage. What's this? Pen. It's on a, a bag, looks like a grocery bag. Uh, each seat back does have pocket storage. Just be careful what you put in there. You don't want to rip it on each side. And then each sliding door does have a little bit of storage and cup holder. And then on here, you do have uh, cup holders right there as well as a power outlet, okay? Now, you can slide these forward just depending on how much space you need in the back. It does have, come on, geez, nobody. It does have an armrest that probably has never been pulled out before uh, with two cup holders. And then you do have the controls here to, uh, uh, for your air conditioning and vents and uh, fan. And then it does have vents that go all the way back. This looks like a uh, an air purifier over here as well. All right. It looks like it does have this aftermarket uh, monitor here. I don't know if it works. I don't have my test DVDs with me, but we could test that while you're here. Now, just real quick to, uh, to swivel these around. All you're going to do is flip this up. And maybe I could do it. And as you can see, you just, you just push it to one side and that will swivel, okay? So I'm not going to do it all the way. I'll let I can show that when you're here, okay? And again, we'll get this power uh, sliding door fixed. Same thing back here. This is all on a uh, rail system. So depending on how much space you need, you can bring these all the way back. But look at how much space. I mean, they're just an, I had an uh, Alford. Just an amazing amount of space in these things. And you got cup holders, a little bit of storage on each side, okay? And then you can uh, put these up against the side. These uh, will go down flat. You gotta slide them forward and they'll go up out of the way. It looks like these, I don't know what that is, aftermarket speakers uh, back here, all right? Wait. Let's go to the front, show you the engine compartment. Then gonna wrap this video up. And I am gonna go get some water. All right, there you have it. This is a 2.4 liter uh, engine, which will be cleaned during the detailing process. And there you go. 2005 Toyota Alphard, 85,000 kilometers on it. Again, about 54,000 miles. Military price is down to 6,400 with additional military discount. We'll get it down to 6,200. Again, while you're here, please ask the information guy about on a lot discounts and you will get a lower price on this. But for now, the 6,200 is gonna include a two year JCI, the one year bumper to bumper full warranty, the 2023 road tax and a 10% sales tax is already included. Only thing on top is going to be the American insurance requirement, whether you're going to liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and we can assist you with that here. Touching on these warranties real quick, yes, there are two-year warranties out here. However, they're not the best things in this slice, bread, so don't be fooled by them. Stop by, we'll explain why. But we do encourage you to shop around, go to the dealer, see what they have, check out the condition, pricing, and mileage of their vehicles, then stop by Johnny's Used Cars, let us show what we have, what our program's all about, and how we can assist you. We are definitely making a difference out here because we are different. One of the many reasons why we did win the Sergeant Stripes Best of the Pacific Magazine's Best Place to Buy a Car Award uh, for uh, this year, okay? Uh, stop by, we'll show you why, like we have many, many others. So don't forget two ways to pay for it, U.S. dollars cash outright, or take advantage of the 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Either way, we're good to go. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.